Did we do it? Yes. What a scary voice. Such a pity. You understand fate, yet you still fight against it with all of your will. If more people were like you, then perhaps the fall could have been prevented. But it's too late now. Shadow them. The Kaya. At last. <laughs> you. <laughs> Fixing, isn't it? The look on your face is priceless. Shut up. But what are we going to do? Something's coming. He has voice.
Yuko and Cass. Kesuke. Hidetobushi and Chihiro. Munchiki and Mitsuko. Officer Kurosawa. Who's this girl? Natsuki. Okay. Gotta stay calm. Natsuki is here. Just like Fuka was when she saved me. I'm the one who said we'll always be connected. That's how I know you're still hanging in there, Fuka. I'm scared as hell right now. But I won't give up. Right, Fuka? Eager summon us. There's no need to worry. This isn't the afterlife. You're still alive. Do you remember what I once told you? How the strength of your social links will determine your potential. Listen. Can you hear the many voices? Each one's power is limited, yet they all reach out to you. Can you feel them? Yes, I sense them. Close your eyes and listen carefully. Their voices may be faint, but certainly you hear them. A mysterious mass of energy is gathering. The powerful emotion of your friends and loved ones are flowing into your heart. I always have your back, Chow. All I can do right now is pray. But, whatever it is, man, I know you can do it. I know you're facing a difficult task, but I truly believe that you can overcome any obstacle. Something frightful is going on. We won't give up. That's right, dear. Chow Chan would want us to lose hope. Something crazy going on here, but I know you're out there doing all you can, Chow. So I won't lose my cool either. You taught me that. Because you gave me hope, I'll be alright. So please, hang in there. <laughs> it's it's obvious who he is, is, you know, it's the silhouette. Oh God, this can't be happening. I wish I could talk to him and calm myself down. I don't even know what he looks like, but I hope he's okay. He has to be. I can feel it. Chao Kun, I know you're trying to stay focused. You were there when I needed you. I hope I can do the same. Hey Chao Kun, can't you believe what's going on? I know you must be doing everything you can, so I will too. Everyone else is scared, but not me. You show me how to be tough. I won't give up. Chosama, what are you doing? I hope you are okay. I am here for you, like you were there for me. What on earth made me think of you at a time like this? Well, I suppose you did teach me a thing or two about loyalty. You must be fighting the good fight right about now. Well, you told me that running away never solved nothing. So I'm here for you, kid. I'll take on any challenge that comes my way, without complaining about it. You told me that, child. I bet you're fighting right now too, huh? Save me, child. I was so blind before. I'm sure you got things under control, right? You always do. I know I'm not the only one who suffered. You've endured a lot too. But you can't just give up. 
It's awfully dead. Can you hear them? These are the voices of hope that wish to help you. Separately, they are weak. But together, they will bring about a great change in you. Now is the time to draw on the true strength of the bonds you have forged. I never dreamed of seeing that card with my own eyes. This is indeed a surprise. Behold, the last power you and I shall unveil. It is the power to bring about a new beginning, or the ultimate end. It may be possible now, with this newfound power. You may be able to defeat the one who cannot be defeated. What you have in your hands is the power of the universe. Nothing is outside the realm of possibility for you now. We will soon reach your destination. It seems that in addition to death, fate has also dealt you the wild card. The wild card. You must accept your destiny. Our contract has been fulfilled. I have completed my role as well. You were truly a remarkable guest. Yay!
Don't give up. We have to believe in him. Give him strength. Take my life if you must. The Quarrel Friendship Church in you. He's going to face it all by himself! Fuka. No, he's not alone! I won't let him die! Junpei. Man, it's very cool, man. I forgot how cool it is. Where are we? Did Nyx create this place? Or was it him? Is he alright, Fuka? What happened? Everything was engulfed by a bright light. I don't sense him. Don't tell me he... No! That can't be! You don't even say his name. Try again! He can't be the only one! You gotta be kidding me. Damn it! Not again! We all decided to put our lives on the line. In fact, we came here knowing we would most likely die. How could I be so powerless? This is what I was trying to prevent. You're there, aren't you? I know you are! I refuse to believe that you're gone! Answer me! I know you can hear me! We're here. Please let us hear your voice. Everyone is desperately calling out to you. Don't worry. Oh, he has voice. That voice. I will sleep once again. Oh, it's Ryoji, man. It's Ryoji Mochizuki. Normal days will return to this universe for you. And for him. He's found the answer to life's greatest question. It just happened a bit sooner than it will for the rest of you. Life's greatest question. I guess you'll find the answer one day as well. You too are a precious living thing. You just need to realize how the bonds of friendship have changed you. The dark hour will soon vanish from this world. All will truly be relinquished from its dominion, and the legacy of life will continue. Congratulations. You have the miracle you sought. We shall meet again someday.
Tartarus. battle has ended. The Tartarus and the Dark Hour have disappeared. By an unexpected miracle, the world was saved from the fall. Peace was restored and people resumed their busy life. No one remembered anything but the extraordinary chance of event. And so, the season changed. Once more, one month later,